My name is Timothy Liu. I'm an associate professor at MIT and an associate member of the Broad Institute. Uh, my lab and I are interested in working in the field of synthetic biology. Synthetic biology is an emerging engineering discipline. It's really focused on bringing uh, more powerful techniques for quicker and more accurate engineering of biological systems. And what's really allowed this field to take off over the last decade or so has been the influx of uh, people who come from pretty non-traditional backgrounds, people like physicists, engineers, um, non-biological scientists who are interested in un understanding biology and manipulating it. And on the other hand, um, there's been a technological uh, advancement in our ability to read and write DNA. And that's given us kind of the raw tools that we need for understanding a biological system and then reprogramming it for new, new functions. So there are several examples where synthetic biology has started to make real impacts on human diseases. So one of the key examples uh, is in the area of diagnostics. So for example, as a PhD student, um, I engineered these uh, particles known as bacteriophages, which essentially are uh, uh, bacterial viruses that recognize uh, bacterial cells. And what we've done is to turn those bacteriophages uh, into, into microscopic detectors of the presence of bacteria that allows us essentially to recognize the presence of pathogens um, in a variety of different settings, including in food or in clinical settings, much more rapidly than we could previously. Another uh, example of how synthetic biology can, can help our understanding of human diseases is through technologies such as uh, gene editing. So by being able to um, insert and manipulate uh, the human genetic code, we can create variants of genes and test how those variants link uh, into disease conditions. There are a variety of projects that we work on that are actually quite intimately related to human disease. So one example of that is we're quite interested in understanding the human microbiome, which is the collection of bacteria that lives inside of us. And the current techniques for understanding such systems are largely observational. And what we've been doing is to engineer living microbes that can actually go into the gut and into other microbiomes and actually live there and sense and respond to those local environments. And by doing so, we can map out um, some of the interesting uh, functional properties of the microbiome and how it relates to human health. The, the Broad has been an excellent place for us to apply synthetic biology to human diseases. It's, an, it's a great amalgamation of scientists, engineers, and clinical uh, folks. And that allows us really to take some very basic concepts, uh, rapidly translate that into um, uh, experiments, and then apply that to uh, applications uh, of, to human diseases.